Hey, Walker Wildcats. Today I need to teach you a few things that you can do if you finish your project early. I call those people early finishers. The first thing you need to do is clean up your area and put away all of your art supplies and of course put your artwork where it belongs. And then you have three options. The first option is to come over to the bookshelf and pick a book that you would like to read. Now please notice how nicely stacked the books are. And boys and girls, it's a privilege to come read a book. So the first thing I do when I pick my book is I find a book that I want, and I think I want this bright yellow book right here. Now sometimes when I try and pull the book out like this, it just makes like a huge mess and everything falls down. That's not the best way. The best way is to unstack the books, pick the book that you want, set it down, stack all of the books back, and then take your book back to your table or somewhere in the room like on a bean bag and only one person per bean bag. Or you can sit on the rug or anywhere you'd like and read your book. Then when you're done, take your book and put it right back where you found it. This is how the bookshelf should stay, not like this. That's not respectful to our books. The second option that you have is free draw. And I have some books right here that you can use to help you draw. Zentangle, How to Draw 3D, How to Draw People, I Can Draw Everything. And so you can take one of these books back to your table and go get a piece of extra scrap paper from the art cart and draw whatever you would like. And you do get to take that artwork home the day that you make it. These books are on the left side of Cat in the Hat. Please do not put them back on this side. Because on this side are origami books. Now I know that I've not taught you how to do origami ever. And so this is a learn on your own experience. And so what I do if I choose to do the origami, I pick an origami book, like this one, it's called Easy Origami. Set that aside. I open up the white box. And in the red folder that's in the very front, there's origami paper. I take one piece of origami paper back to my table, and I try my best to make origami. Now one thing to keep in mind is I cannot help you make origami because my job right now is to help the other students finish up the project that we're working on. So all of this is independent work. This is nothing that I will help you with. It's options of things you can do when you finish early. And of course, when you're done with the origami book, come put it back on the right side of Cat in the Hat. Close the tub. And whatever origami you made, you may take home. 